We are working on the GIF editing assignment, GIF short movie playlist. It needs to be about one minute long and it needs to have a story background. So you need to develop your story map and I like to develop my stories off the Khan Academy structure that I've learned. So story map looks like this. It needs a beginning, middle, and an end basically. You need to have characters, a setting, a problem, and a solution and you need a story script written out. So basically what are you going to say? First plan this and then that can lead to this. My tip for writing stories all the time is using the Khan Academy structure. This can help you fill in all these blanks. Once there was every day but then and then and then until finally now. Okay so here's what I came up with for my story. Once there was an old man who yelled at kids cutting through his yard on the way home from school. Every day he'd hear kids passing his house and get angry about it. But then the sounds stopped. The man thought his hearing had gone out. The man went to the doctor to check on it. Until finally he saw the kids cutting through the neighbor's yard and he celebrated. So it needs to be something short and simple. But if you look at that you can tell my beginning is the man getting mad at the kids. My middle is the man wondering why the kids have stopped making noise and the end is him discovering they found a different route home. The characters are the man and the kids. The setting is the man's house and outside his house and there's an escape setting to the doctor. The problem is the man doesn't like kid noises and then the man wants to know what happened to the kid noises. The solution is the kid noises. The kids took their noises elsewhere. So Basically, if you follow this structure, here is your script, really. And then you can just change the way it's worded so that it's not like every script sounds the same, you know. Um, this is the structure for every script, but it's good to change up the words that you use so it's not like, oh, here we go again, once there was, every day, and then, and then, and then, finally. Um, you know, make it a little bit better sounding. So, that's my script. Now, um, I could put it on the back of my story map, really, you know, right here, and fancy it up. And I'm ready to turn in my story plan for that. So great. Next part is to, now that you know what your story needs to be, gather the GIFs. So I've suggested using Giphy. So basically, you're searching for things that are related to your story. So my story has an old man yelling at kids in his yard so I looked up old man yelling old man angry old man lawn and found some clips and this is a gif editing assignment so you just save these as images you save the image as a gif and then the gif has the series of pictures that makes it look like movement um, you're going to edit those gifs together so old man hearing kids passing I, I want old man looking confused. I don't think I got one of those. So I'll demonstrate old man looking confused. You will see it's not always an old man. And it's always not, not always what I'm looking for. I already downloaded that one actually. And sometimes if you click on one that you had downloaded before, that's kind of funny. Um, some similar ones may pop up so maybe this is the best I have here and now I can look and see what else comes up is there anything else okay I got kind of a man sitting in his chair at home well, maybe, maybe this could go in it so anything that you think could go right click save image as and then just title it by what it is man in chair I will admit this is ageist because I'm acting like all old men look alike because I need to get a series of gifts and put them together for a story. I'm getting different old men. But hopefully if I have good narration and tell the story well, I might try that one too. I don't know. Save image as old man dancing. Okay. Ah, see I already have one. Like that. Okay. So, you got them downloaded. You want them all in the same folder. Good process for editing. Put all your stuff related in the same folder. So I'm making a new folder, going File, New Folder. 
and calling it old man gif edit. Okay, now I need to find all those files. I believe they went in my downloads folder. Oh, nope, here, here are some on my desktop. Gather them all into your folder. Peeking gif goes in there. Manage share goes in there. All of this goes in there. I'm sorry. And see, I just need to sort by date. That would make it easier for me. See, I found a lot. It's going to take a lot of gifts to make a one minute movie. Drag them all into the same folder. Now you're ready to start editing. So whichever editor you're going to use is the one that you should use to put the gifts together. But as you can see, it plays them. So I got little video clips that I have to edit together to make my story. And I'm going to start trying to put those together based on what my story plan was and see which ones seem to work best together. I'll add some music and narration as fit and end up with a nice little story. So for the second step in this assignment, what you'll do Daddy. is you will upload that folder that you made to Google Drive. Mama. You'll get the link to that folder. So I'll just take the folder, upload it to Google Drive. Ah. Right here. I'm going to put it in my AVP folder on Google Drive. And then I'm going to get that shareable link to that folder, and you'll turn it in on the question posted in Google so that I can see your media assets for your file and your plans and then I will um, you'll turn it in and next time you will put your project in that folder and edit from it you'll export your project and we'll get to see what you did